Welcome or welcome back to our channel, Living on the Ohio River. Hi, I'm Kara Henshaw from Key Associates Signature Realty, and I love to do these videos of work, living, and playing here on the Ohio River. If you are new to our channel, make sure you tap that subscribe button. We wouldn't want you to miss videos that we do at least once a week. I'm always doing fun videos. Uh, you never know where I'll be. I may be in Evansville all the way to Louisville across the Ohio River, and that may be in Indiana or Kentucky. So today I am going to do a video on crime in Louisville. Um, I get a lot of questions. I get a lot of comments. Louisville is dangerous. You know, I don't want to live there. I'll get shot. That is not true. Obviously, there is crime in the city, like any city. And so what I thought I'd do is help you do your homework if you are looking to live in Louisville. So stay tuned. I'm going to kind of dig into some websites that are useful for you to zone in maybe on areas you're looking and kind of do some homework um, in educating yourself on the Louisville area regarding crime. So here we go. Let me take you on some websites and give you some information to help you make a informed decision on relocating here to Louisville. Okay, so I am going to start with a website that a lot of people use um, to just kind of look at general things on different cities. It's neighborhoodscout.com. And uh, sometimes I think these can be a little overwhelming. Um, this is, I, I kind of zone in on crime. Obviously they have overviews and everything else. If you want to look at different areas, real estate, demographics, but crime is our focus today. So this is an interesting picture. So it gives you the safest to the most dangerous. So if you zone in, you can see that on the outskirts east side, um, or I should say west side, sorry, of Louisville, southeast, are, are safer as you get farther out. It is the safest as you get closer to downtown. You're going to be in your most dangerous areas right here. So you can kind of see this is this is more downtown. And then as you get out more towards South or St. Matthews and just kind of, you know, out more towards the loop and, and then on out you know, near Hurstbourne, all this area, it is going to be safer um, for living. Now, this could be overwhelming. This this looks like, wow, this is very dangerous. There's a lot of dangerous spots uh, in Louisville. Um, yes, there is dangerous things. Like any city, there will be crime. Um, and what I thought it would be do, just to give you a little bit better insight, is you could actually go, there is a website, um, it's called uh, Crime Mapping is what I've done, .com in Louisville. I can actually put the link in the, the video uh, comments as well. So this is actually by the Louisville Police will give you an idea of where crimes are reported by week. So you can, you can get really detailed. Let's say, okay, you know, I want to look, look at Middleton, St. Matthews area. You can see there, there is less crime right here. Uh, as you kind of go in, let me get a little closer in, uh, as you go farther downtown, let's just kind of zone in here. We're, we're downtown right here. You can see, especially the east side right here in all this area, there is a lot more crime. Uh, the, the south side, like the um, old Louisville area, there is more crime as well uh, sitting in this area. This is East, Eastern Parkway, which is where you kind of go through the Germantown area and uh, back, back out here by St. Matthews. And then you also have um, the Highlands all in this area. You can kind of get a feel, so zone in, the more you zone in, see, you can get a feel of what crimes are taking place in those areas. So like, let's say you're looking at a house and you wanna kind of see how close you are to this location. You can enter your address here and then it'll show you all the crime around where you're looking to potentially live. So another good thing, I mean, you can also click on see what type of crimes were taking place and what the police reported. Um, one thing um, that I like to look at, this is just a, a chart. Let me zone in a little harder here, a little farther out, sorry. Um, going right back out to here. So this is all available. You can go to charts 
and I, I think you can zone in uh, by the charts as well, closer to the area as well. But this gives you an idea of what kind of crime summary is going on. So you have uh, assault is one of the biggest. Uh, then you got, I can't read, uh, burglary, vandalism, vehicle break-in, there's a lot. Um, obviously, stealing, uh, sex crime, robbery, theft, uh, homicide, and fraud. Uh, drugs and alcohol, get an idea of disturbing peace. This gives you kind of a summary of what kind of crimes are taking place. Um, you know, obviously, when you kind of zone in, let's go back. Back to map. You can kind of look at these colors and then decide if that is something, uh, you know, I, I said there obviously is a crime being reported, maybe where you're wanting to live, but maybe it's, you know, different type of crimes. Uh, you know, it's not someone shooting someone uh, versus theft or maybe fraud. You don't know what, what is actually taking place closer to where you're wanting to live. So this is a great website if you really are looking at potential areas, a, a particular house, and you wanna zone in on exactly what kind of crimes are taking place right around your neighborhood, I would definitely check this site out. It is, is wonderful. It's on crimemapping.com. Um, I actually went there through Louisville Police, but, um, it looks like you can actually here let me make sure it's crimemapping.com uh, this is where i'm at but i went there through the louisville police so i'm not sure if that'll get you straight there if you're having problems finding it reach out i will will text you the link for sure uh, but this this is probably what i would use um, versus maybe what i showed initially because some of those more, more generic neighborhood scouting websites are a little bit more vague um, they don't give you as much detail, so it looks a little bit more frightening. And so I think this is a, a better site, especially when you want to add an address and look at what kind of stuff is happening around you. But like I said, you can kind of go in here and you can see what actually happened. You know, this is harassment. This is burglary. This was theft. Um, this was criminal mischief. mischief. Uh, larceny you can kind of go in and, and look uh, what kind of things br vehicle break in like I said every I'm not saying crime is good but different crimes are taking place in different areas so it's, it's definitely worth checking out you can really scope in on what is going on in the areas that you're looking um, obviously that's just multiple records in there um, it just yeah I mean I could dwell on you can it's, it's a site that you can definitely dig in and get a lot of information so this video isn't going to be real long but I just kind of wanted to, to go ahead and and just kind of take crime you know by the you know, and bring it up front because I do get a lot of comments on my YouTube channel about crime in the area and that it's an unsafe city it is a great city Louisville is a great city and like any city does have crime I think the biggest thing is just educating yourself, making sure you look at areas of where you want to live. Um, like I said here, this just tells you on a more higher level, just, you know, what's safer, what's not. And uh, kind of making that statistic. The crime index uh, shows it 5%, safer than 5% of the U.S. cities. So it shows it low. I mean, it, it doesn't look good when you look at it from these statistics. Number of crimes, property and then your crime rate per thousand residents. So these sites can scare you, I agree. And that's why I think it's important that you really dig in to the details of what type of crime is taking place and actually where you're looking to live. Um, but it, you know, here's the stats. Like I said, I wanted to just address front on what it is, I'm not gonna hide anything. It is something that does come up for Louisville. And if you are looking at Louisville, I want to make sure you have the best educated uh, decision you can make with having the data to look at. So hopefully this helps you uh, in your relocation in uh, the Louisville area or even if you're in Louisville and you didn't know about the site. So I hope you liked our video on our scenario and summary. I hope you liked our video on crime in Louisville. I, I think it gave you some good information 
uh, on where to look to identify where the more crime areas are in Louisville if you are looking here. And I'd also be able to help. So just reach out if you are looking to relocate to the area. I got your back. You can call me at 812-686-3268. And I look forward to hearing from you. And until next time, I'll see you then.